I want to start off by saying, Ethan, it's great to see you again. Last time we were talking Blaze with Ben Dickey and I was handing you, my business partner, John Stemple, and I were giving you a bottle of whiskey uh, here in Houston, Texas. Sadly, I'm sure I drank it already. <laughs> <laughs> Joshua, it's great to meet you. And my mom, actually, Ethan, who you also met, is sitting to my left. And she wanted me to tell you, Joshua, that her favorite, John Brown is good, but her favorite character in this show is Onion. Tell her I say thank you. Mom, you can jump in real quick and say that Onion. There's Onion. I love Onion. I love you. Okay. Uh, <laughs> thank you. Thank you. I appreciate hey, it. Can I, can I tell you a funny story? Yeah. yeah. I showed the series to my mom, and the first thing she said when it was over is, she said, how did you find that young man? And I said, well, he came in an audition, and she just said, Ethan, you are so lucky. You know? <laughs> totally <laughs> agree. Oh, now, my God. <laughs> how did this young man come into your life? You are so lucky. So, Joshua, actually, I'm going to start with you, man. When you found out who you were going to be working with, what a cast, what was your first reaction? I actually didn't find out uh, who I was working with, like the whole cast, until I think when I got to Virginia, which was like in June. But I didn't know I was working with Ethan Hawke, and I was super excited because, you know, it's Ethan Hawke. You know, all my, a lot of my favorite movies have him in it. And then when I found out about the rest of the cast, I was super excited, not even just to work with them, but excited to learn from them. Because a lot of them are veteran actors that know so much about acting and that helped me a lot. So Ethan, how did this uh, story find its way to you and what was the appeal? What inspired you to turn this into this fantastic series? It had been a long time since I read a book I just couldn't put down. It had me laughing, it had me crying, and I just, I just loved it so much, and I wanted to give it to everybody for Christmas. I, I wanted everybody to read it. And then slowly I realized, you know, this limited series had started. When I was a kid, it was, there was just TV shows or movies, you know, and, and now this whole thing exists, this idea of a, a bigger canvas, a longer form. And I realized that we could tell this story in its entirety. And, it was really exciting to me.